Howdy y'all, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, I think we're gonna leave this fucking shithole. <laughs> we have an established plan, we know what we're doing. We got business down south in Saint Denis. Back alley muggins. And actually some bounties I've never done before. I, I don't even know what bounty we're going to be walking in on. Because I don't think it's said, right? It just showed a preview picture of um, Elias Green. But we've already caught Elias Green. Actually, it was quite easy to catch, too. It was kind of an embarrassment. Check the stables down here too. See what kind of horses there are. Maybe this is where we stable Coley and we get a new horse. Shit, if I get a new horse, what should I name it? Huh? I'll have to put some I'll have to put some thought into that. It's gotta stay within the, the theme we've been doing since the epilogue started, and that's been naming horses after famous western characters, so have to think of a good one. Uh, uh, okay. I think I got it. I think I got one. It depends on the color of the coat, though. No one can stop us, eh? Oh, holy shit, that, running into that pelican scared me to death. Look, I just shit my pants, oh my god. That was awful. It's such a horrible honking noise. Alright, there's no lady here. What time is it? 7am? I don't think the ghost of Agnes Downs is going to be showing up, is she? Nah, we're already halfway to, to Saint Denis. Let's just go here first. Check for a backyard mugging. Back alley mugging. And if that don't pan out, we'll go swing by the police station and see what's up. And you know what? May as well clean myself up again. Go get another clean shave. Extra clean. I don't want any skin left on my face. Howdy. Howdy. Oh, Jesus. Rabbit pig. Damn, that's some nice looking corn back there. what we've been able to accomplish in the last uh <laughs> you hear that voice actor you got a problem with me oh my god that was fucking hilarious hilarious i can't even do the voice well for it you got a problem with me i want to fucking hear that again that was hilarious <laughs> oh my lord Howdy. Please, take a seat. So what'll it be today? Holy shit, I am nasty. Uh, facial hair, please. Trim. Uh, actually, it would be a style, right? Full style. Oh, I'm still extra clean shaven. I'm just dirty. Okay. Hey, I got a face somewhere. You're real helpful. Thank you. Actually, you know what? If I go through his establishment. And cut across over here. Your choice, bud. You won't get a better cut in town. 
takes me straight to the, uh, the, the end. Way. We'll take a bath real quick. And get the bite, a bite to eat. I want to minimize the uh, horse travel that I have in this uh, disgusting town. I'd like a room for the night. Okay, room's all set. Just head up there. Whoa! How did no one want? How did it do that? Oh, what do you have? A room for tonight, please. That was okay, weird. Okay, room's all set. Just head upstairs when you're ready. Take a lobster bisque. There you go. Mmm, lobster bisque. Real Maine lobster. Not bad, huh? Mm-hmm. Can I also have a bath? I need to wash up. Got a bath available? I'll have the girls make yeah, it for okay. you. Okay, just put this Bonjour. Bonjour. Everyone's a liar at this table. That's no lie. <laughs> Everyone's a liar at this table. And that's no lie. <laughs> uh don't think your logic's working out. Uh, no, thank you. Oh, water. Oh, am I scrubbing the pomade out of my hair? Probably. Would you like help in there? Hell no. Nah. I'm a married man. No, I, uh, got this. All right. Suit yourself, sweetheart. Yeah, Saint Denis, like, they know luxury. Look, oh my god, look at that bouquet back there. You see that? Lilies? That's definitely lilies. Maybe lavender? Can you get dark purple lilies? What's that flower that's going, like, straight up in the middle? Fucking sick. I love that grandfather clock, too. That's fucking sick. I was, like, the aperitif they serve. Nice. Laundered clothes, clean butt. I'm ready to leave. I ain't even gonna stay in the room. I'm These just leaving. I'm tired of them riding through the streets. Saint Denis never used to be this bad. Bet that cleaned you up. <laughs> yeah, that was nasty, well, dude. Well. Bonjour. I will Don't have. Let me rush you none. Prime rib. Now this is a meal. Bonjour, monsieur. All right, let's go. And to return, it's through this alley. You a long ways from the ranch, cowboy. Don't speak to me. Kids, the only ones you're safe and Sultan, huh? Oh, be quiet, will you? Ah, oh, hell, make a break for it. Run away. Oh shit, this can't be real. Ah, oh, Christ. Didn't I say don't speak to me? Go get hey, your grill out of bed with someone else. Shit, the law's mad at me. Careful there. Watch out, moron. The law wouldn't be so mad at me if it was just, uh, if that kid would have just been nice. Come hold on. On way around if I can't hit cab, eh? Then fuck you. You're quite the horse. I do dress John up like a fucking cowboy, though. I will say Look that. Out for each other, huh? Actually, you know what? This normal clothes is like the cowboy set or whatever, right? You and me, fella. Back alley mugging is supposed to happen here. Some woman uptown has nothing but gold teeth. <laughs> nothing but gold teeth. Look out, mister. Hey, look out. Hey, try going around people. Okay, I thought those NPCs were going to uh, do something. Damn, this is a slump. Let's get out of here before we really do get robbed. Get on out the way! What's Excuse wrong with me? you? You know, it's it had to have happened early on.
It had to have happened early on. All right, let's hit the stables next. Let's see if we can buy a new horse. Holy's great and all, but uh, couldn't do it without you. This time is is over. What did I do to you? Turned on me. What are you doing? Why are you stopping? These NPCs, man, they want to, they're on a death wish, you know? A whole lot of ugly business here. Atlantic Electric Company. Keep it up, big boys. Good morning. Good morning. All right, here we go. Woo! Hey, mister. This horse got worms or something. Damn <laughs> worms. Didn't you want me to keep it's that over in the stable? Oh my god, that's so bad. Oh, they got the they got the Arabian. Oh, Turkoman as well. Wow, look at that gold Turkoman. Yeah, gold. What's this? A Nakoda. Okay. What's the Arabian's coat? Just straight black. Wow. I don't have a Turkoman. What are the other coat colors for a Turkoman? Do we even know? Back to work. Email horse too. Only four hundred dollars for a Turkoman? That seems cheap. It seems abnormally cheap. We don't have an Arabian. Last one was silver. This one could just be obsidian, you know. Damn, he looks surly. Look after your horse good. Be damn sure it'll look after you. Yeah, that's true. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't want to buy it. I did not buy it. Managed own horses. I mean, I need my girl. I need Stella back, you know? You're a thoroughbred? I could probably sell Rachel. Rachel wasn't even the name of the horse that I wanted. Holy is only worth twenty six dollars. <laughs> working with animals is better than working with Rachel's one twenty, but Stella, the, the nine hundred nine hundred and two. Look at that. I'm going back to Stella. Saddle her up. I'll get you switched out. And then I want to horse provisions. Here we go. What was that shit that I was feeding to my horses the other day? Oh, he doesn't show. He doesn't have it in here. Horse stimulant, horse medicine, horse reviver. Definitely gonna buy some more beets, some hay, sugar cubes, and then uh, what's the um, horse care package? This horse care package. Oh, services. Don't hurt to have more. Beautiful. Ah, oh, Stella. It's good seeing you again, my girl. All right, let's get to business. Maybe if we find a different coded Missouri Foxtrotter, we'll get it. I love you, lady. Oh, this horse is fast. Jesus Christ. Good morning. All right, let's go watch the show first. And then we're going to uh, see what's going on inside this police station. Wow, that's such a nice horse. Why, hello there. Howdy. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Buy a ticket, please. Need a ticket, please. Please, through those double doors. Through those double doors.
Oh, there's someone there. Greetings, gentle folk! Welcome to my Man, still show! Here? I am Aldridge T. Abington, bringer of daily entertainment that will enchant you. I have traveled the world, seeking delights and amusements, visiting every city, town, hamlet, and village of importance. I have seen dogs that can fly, <laughs> monkeys oh that can sew, <laughs> and a half-man that, despite being an addle-headed fop, could juggle and please a harem at the same time. It's true! Ooh. Now, let's get down to it! This, is this last remarkable show, woman first attained notoriety seducing alligators out of the swamp and into a pot of stew. Her snake dance will oh, leave you go. questioning allegory. The mysterious Maya. Okay. We've seen her before. Maybe she changed her dance up over the last like 10 years. Imagine if John has no cheering voice lines for this. Just claps. She ain't playing! There we go. Bring her neck! Oh my god, that's a terrible act of antagonize. Give us more! Buckster. John, you're a savage. Look at that lady. Kiss that snake. There we go. That's what I wanted. That's a big snake! Nice. This is amazing! Wait, I said this is something. All right, Serpent Lady! Uh. Damn, don't mess with her! Crowd so dumb. That snake looks mad. Bravo, bravo! You now understand her unbounded popularity and why she receives so many gentlemen callers. <laughs> mm. I am honored to present to you the greatest escape artist ever to live. Wow. Compositions have been wow. written about his incredible <laughs> feats of wonderment. Uh. I cannot delay this congregation one more second of experiencing the phenomenal display of the one and only Benjamin Lazarus. Oh, don't we know him? <laughs> How do we know Ladies Benjamin Lazarus? Gentlemen. Oh, and no, we've just seen him yet before. Benjamin Lazarus, the most incredible entertainer the world has ever seen. I have delighted concert saloons, variety theaters, and dime museums. 
I have just returned from London, where audiences stood riveted for an entire hour as I attempted to escape a pair of handcuffs. Can you never yes. Do that again? I am the king of handcuffs. Oh. But tonight, as promised in the stories you've read in the newspaper, I will introduce my latest invention. This steamer, Trunk of Death. Oh, look, we've seen this one. Now, Where did he escape from last time? You are a, aware a water I can barrel? escape from any contraption. In fact, I offer $10 to anyone who can fashion a device that can hold me. Ten dollars! Right. That's a week's wages. This magician a is a phony! maker has tried and failed. Why, I even went to the sheriff and dared him to lock me in jail so I could escape. He wouldn't do it. I performed jail escapes completely without clothes and he still declined, knowing that no jail can hold me. Oh my God. Let me thoroughly explain my apparatus. It is Phonies. especially made steam. Steamer truck manufactured in Pittsburgh. It contains three impenetrable locks, reinforced steel <laughs> bands, and the inside are razor sharp daggers what? that forbid me to move even one inch. He's cheating! Finally, my assistant will place this device over my face that will not allow me to breathe. I can hold my breath longer than anyone in the world, but I cannot hold it forever. Oh now, <laughs> I do not foresee any accident happening, but we know in life accidents do happen. Babies arrive, bones are broken from a horse kick, worse. You got no tell! This is my most dangerous escape yet, and should anything go wrong, while I am attempting to escape, and it is impossible for me to breathe, let me assure you, my assistant is trained in case of an emergency and will rush in with an axe to save my life. Fake magic! <laughs> I pray that does not have to happen. Now, I encourage you to hold your breath with me as I enter this steamer trunk Not many daggers. of death. But I ask you, is it a case or a casket? Oh my God. Get out of here! Yeah. Oh God, careful! Uh, I actually really like the reaction of the audience or half of this shit. It's hilarious. Oh my god. <laughs> what? That trunk looks oh, pretty yes. tight. <laughs> that was crazy weird. Thank you, ladies. Underground and chamber that goes that door, you. that seat, and just kind of slide through. Time and space. Someone's probably sitting there, illusion. and just before the act, they got up and walked away. That scared the shit out of me when he, sh he showed up right there. Yeah, okay. do it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He, he changed. He changed my mind. He's no longer a huckster. Oh, 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 how? How did he do it? Ah, oh, incredible! Thank you for your positive accolades. I, I put on an incredible show, don't I? <laughs> Incredulous, awe-inspiring. I encourage. Any man in this audience who has a high opinion of himself to square off with our next act. Mm. She is the strongest woman alive. Whoa. Presenting oh. Miss Hortensia from the deepest of Bavaria. Yep, Hortensia. We've seen her before. She's got the muscles for days. Old muscles princess, you know what I mean? Whoa, she got limber. <laughs> On with 
like the show! She's not really a lady. <laughs> Come on! Come on! Oh, that ain't too yeah. bad. That's it! Wouldn't say that's ox like yet. <laughs> she likes to scrap! What's she gonna do on this? The whole splits thing? Yep. Holy fuck. Yeah, yeah. Not bad. Y'all see this? Those chairs out of the way, we're tense here. I have traveled across this country from New York to San Francisco to Blackwater. Amazing! No man can defeat me. Many have tried and all have failed. Is there any man in this audience who thinks he can take me on? I will make you the laughing stock of this town. <laughs> She's a big one. Come up on this stage and fight me. Can I fight her? Come on! Get up here! Will no one accept my challenge? Why am I gonna do it? I'm gonna do it. Step up into the spotlight! How about Come that? on! Take you all. Oh shit. My next okay. victim. Have fun. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy this, little lady. I've had about enough of your mouth. Shouldn't you be making me some bills right Lord. now? I'll Damn. make you into some bills. Come on! Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Lucky I had me some whiskey. Yeah, what's the matter? <sighs> All right. I'm done playing around with you. I'm not done. Come on! <laughs> I'll do it! <laughs> Come on! Right here, give it all you got! Yeah? <laughs> this is yeah. the best! <laughs> oh. God damn it. I'm yeah. done toying with you! Oh. Oh. Get up! Hell yeah. <laughs> Funny enough, no Bavarian <laughs> accent. <laughs> yeah, he just went, Ugh. You hear that? Ugh. <laughs> what grand entertainment watching a reversal of the sexes. <laughs> <laughs> We've had a stupendous evening, for sure. It is a pleasure to join you in such merriments. Yeah! <laughs> These are the bright spots in our lives, which often terminate without sense or meaning. We are deluded into assuming it was in any way interesting. Be well, good night. And that's it. We have a new show tomorrow. <laughs> a new show tomorrow, huh? Okay. Probably be tomorrow by the time I'm done doing this bounty quest over here. Okay, so now that we've done this, a cigarette card should be here now. And that's it right there. We know. What's it over here? Hang on. I may have to wait for the uh, the room to drain. Can I get into these side rooms? No.
that place should have vacated by now. Nothing over there. Oh, they locked it. Oh, shit. Oh, my God, there's still people in there. Isn't that illegal? I guess we'll come back. Well, I don't think there's anything else I can help you with. Okay. Come on, folks. All aboard. Back outside. Don't run in front of these cops. They're going to be suspicious. here to turn yourself in so I conclude you're a bounty hunter. May I direct you to the poster on the wall there? Okay, Chief. Anthony Foreman. Oh, Miss Tilly's old gang leader. Wow. The former leader of the former brothers gang and, uh, yeah, under sentence for robbery, pandering blackmail, violent behavior, and is spotted uh, spotted in many of the establishments through San Denis slums, including the tavern. The above a reward is offered by B. Lambert, San Denis Police Department. Blah 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 blah. What was the reward money again? Fifth eighty-five dollars. Well then, what does this guy have to say about this? Anthony Foreman, check that saloon in the slum for him. He might have a bounty on his head, but you'd hardly know it. Cares on about his business in the less salubrious parts of town, knowing the law won't dare to come looking. <laughs> okay. Uh, any more information? Is it that you can't go into the slums to get Foreman, or you won't? That's a mighty forward line of inquiry. The slum dwellers can't be helped, sir. Wow. So we're not gonna try. Wow. I'm an asshole. As a matter of fact, I heard about this fella years ago. What more can you tell me of him then? He's a panderer, a thief, a cheat, a braggart. Braggart. Somewhat of a hero to a few mistaken fools. Simply put, the man is just bad for society. Society? Well... It's what you make it. <laughs> I guess all that remains is to bring him in. Not to put too fine a point on it, but don't kill him. Okay. Man, you hey, mind where you're going. You mind where you're going. Have you got something to say to me? No. Don't escalate. Okay. That's what Hello, I like to see. Good oh, yeah. We need the radar back on, don't we? Uh, expanded. There I we missed go. It. All right. Let's go get Anthony Foreman. See, these people go crazy if you even touch the stick. Heaven forbid you make a, a macro or a, 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 a micro correction, Jesus. Macro correction, Jesus. What the hell's wrong with me? Like, see, I didn't touch the stick right there, and I almost hit that guy, and he didn't say shit. I had to touch my stick stick right before that. What a lady you are. It's true, Stella. You are a lady. You have a good night now. Good evening. Alright, let's see if Anthony Foreman's in here. Hey you! What you looking for? Hey, could you help me find an Anthony Foreman? Anthony Foreman? I, uh, this goddamn I don't boy. recollect that name. I'd try the other place. Hey! Where are you going? Oh shit, you he fucking tripped me? me. Hey! I'm still gonna get you! Holy shit! 
Look at that dead dog is being eaten by a pig. Come on, Stella. an easy catch. That was too funny. I stowed him on my horse, Come but I just hucked him onto the ground. Chief wants to see you. Couldn't do it without you, girl. Hey, I think you knew a friend of mine. Tilly Jackson. Tilly Jackson? I ain't heard that name in a time. Hey, you're not the... No. Yeah. He was big. He remembers Arthur. Look, That's funny. If you're with that other friend of hers, I promise to stay away. And I did. Don't bring me in because of Tilly Jackson. <laughs> Things is long settled between us. But I ain't bringing you in for Tilly Jackson. I'm bringing you in because they're paying me. That's a good little conversation. That was a little tie in. That was cool. So it's good to know that. If my cousin was still here, you wouldn't have got me. Yeah, hey, I wouldn't ain't. have had to hide out in no slum, avoiding no bounty. When he got killed and we lost them other boys at Radley's house, that's when things went sour. Oh, that's when Arthur did it. Foreman's ain't been quite so much since then. It's kind of sad. That's what they get for messing with Tilly, though. Here's the station. I'm guessing you ain't on this side of town much. I wouldn't piss on these people if they were burning. Damn. Anthony Foreman. He ain't society's problem no more. He's yours. Well, good to meet you finally, sir. I hope you find our accommodation suitable. Sales back there. Alrighty. Which one, left or right? Hard to tell. Uh, sit down. Get comfortable. I ain't going anywhere. Love that. Well, you're gonna want a hot bath after taking that trip through the slums. Actually. I like the slum. That's it. Oh my God. Well, I hope my men can do as good a job on these outlaws as you have. The rest around here are being made by deputies from now on. No more bounties in Saint Denis, I'm afraid. Saint Denis. All right, that sucks. Good to know. Get out of here, all right. Yeah, all right, I'm leaving. Well, little cherry on top right there. Anthony Foreman's in jail. Let's go ahead and mark this marker off. I don't know if this marker... I can remove this one quite yet, but uh, soon, soon. Yeah, all that's left is just these little couple places, and we're done. Um, I need to check here, I believe. I need to check here. The two right here. There we go. All right. I want to thank you all for hey, watching. Partner.
we're gonna go ahead and cut it here and then uh yeah pick it up next time keep finishing up this stuff we're getting ever and ever closer to being done which is hella cool then we can dedicate the rest of our time to the uh the new zones which is gonna be great because there's a lot that we have to do over there still but until then catch you later you must be Adios. damn stupid if you think you can come back here oh my god what hang on howdy mister hello i don't know who's who's saying that i'm just gonna before we go i'm just gonna go out into this field over here and just get away from the riffraff <laughs> all right adios everybody